the market is crashing. What are the biggest investors doing about it? Hello guys, today we want to talk about the general crypto and stock crash happening right now. What are the experts doing? And at the end of this video, I will tell you what I'm going to do with my personal finance. Before we start, just leave a like and subscribe to the channel, that really helps me. First of all, there is not always one reason for the market to be crashing. I will list the most important ones in this video. Number one, the Feds are going to increase the interest rates. For you that don't know, the Feds is the main bank in the United States that is loaning funds to other banks. Right now, they have near to zero interest rates. Keeps the economy bouncing back and everything uh, working fine after the virus, they are going to increase it. That's why the markets are reacting to it. The unemployment is stabilizing and everything is going back to normal. So they need to put measures in place in order to protect the economy. Second, the Russian war. There is a conflict between Russia and Ukraine right now, and this has a direct impact in the stock and crypto market. Any potential wars are always bad for the market. Next is the stop loss. You know that stop loss is there to protect you from losing more than you can to. So when the stop loss hits, this is an automatic sale. This happens to all the markets and when a lot of people sell, the markets are dropping down. Lastly, there is a combination of reasons that are dragging the markets down. Cheap crisis, inflation and low prices. These reasons are some of the reasons that are making the company not reaching their full potential. That's why they are not hitting their price targets. That's why people are selling because they're scared the company is not solid enough. Now we're going to talk about what the experts are doing when their market is bearish. First is the dollar cost average. People are averaging their position by buying in when the market is low in order to make a stronger position and keep holding companies they believe in. The next one is a very simple strategy, not selling. You are not losing any money until you sell a position. If you don't sell out of any position, you are not in any losses. Any percentage is shown in your platform does not realize gain or loss until you click the sell button. So most of the experts, because they are sure about their position, they keep their positions open or they increase with dollar averaging or they keep it until the market bounce back. Now I'm going to do what I am going to do with my financials. This is not a financial advice. I'm just saying for you to understand what I'm choosing to do with my personal finance. I will keep doing the same thing. I will invest 70% in my real estate portfolio, the money I save in order to purchase real estate. And the next 30% will go to my stock portfolio where I have a dividend portfolio you can see in my other videos. My crypto portfolio is getting reinvested by the NFT games I play, the miner I have here in my house, and every state crypto I have, everything goes back to crypto. That's why I don't take from my savings to put into crypto right now. Thank you for watching the video guys. Feel free to like and subscribe to the channel and also follow me in Instagram. I will be giving out some crypto when I reach a certain amount of followers. Thank you very much. See you in the next one.